Dennis, for that, and of course, we shall be picking the mind of my guest tonight regarding that retreat and what it portends, especially from his viewpoint. The Honorable Jeremiah Kioni is in studio. That conversation with him coming up in a short while. Four suspects linked to robbery with violence reportedly resulting to the death of a guard at a newly established entertainment joint are behind bars following a thwarted robbery attempt with crude weapons recovered from the suspects. Police have have revealed the criminals have been on the radar of police officers following complaints of hangout joints being raided by armed robbers. The arrest comes weeks after TV 47 highlighted a plea for heightened security in the areas of Rero and Juja by residents, as Moiga William now reports. Monday police in Kiambu cracked into a syndicate of armed robbers who have been targeting bar owners and stealing expensive alcoholic drinks. This follows the arrest of four suspected robbers who dared to rob an entertainment joint in Kimbo situated opposite a GSU camp. So uh, Every um, um, information that uh, this is the place they, they intended to, to attack. So as soon as they began executing their, their heinous act, the police were able to move in and uh, you can see the results of uh, that stakeout. The suspected robbers who reportedly killed a guard at the newly established Midnight Gardens are said to have switched off electricity and later disconnected a standby generator which is the club's alternative source of power before they tied the guard on duty with a rope and killed him using a power enhanced metallic club. I know there's a fatality that has happened this morning and it's been caused by this gang. Uh, the, the Manda weapon is right there. According to Kiambu County Police Commander Michael Moshiri, police have been trailing the criminals for some time after they successfully conducted six similar raids at newly established clubs in the county. All this while conducting the operations with a Toyota Voxy car fitted with fake number plates. These people using crude weapons, they are able to attack um, you know, um, the management and steal um, you know, uh, alcoholic products. They have been, we can see there are sacks there where they are able to stuff these products. Mid-January, TV47 reported a spike in robbery incidences where the perpetrators, a group of four men operating in a white and black Toyota Voxy cars, targeted entertainment joints along the developing areas of Kiambu and Juja. The same group of people are uh, using the same resources, motor vehicles, uh, and same uh, methods of, of, of access, gaining access uh, and, and infiltrating, of course, our, our penetrating our security measures. The yeah. technology. Na wakiweka technology, wanakuja na jurisa, ware vitengo wa serikari, ware wako hapa. CCTV footage analyzed by TV47 showed at least three premises that have been broken into by the same crew of robbers at least in the same vehicles, a white Toyota and a black Voxy car, which had its number plates changed. Panda, 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 Mwige William, TV.